Hi YouTube, this is Omar. Um, I'm going to show you today a new ROM for the uh, Note 3. This is called the Beam ROM. It's for the international version, the Exynos uh, Note 3. Uh, just by looking at it, you see that it's actually based on the S5 uh, TouchWiz. Uh, also, it has some of the uh, software on for the S5 um, it will bring uh, a new kind of uh, uh, of uh, multitasking also if you see on top the toggles are also trying to mimic of what we're gonna find on the S5 um, besides some other tweaks like the circles and this one that I, uh, I kind of like, it, it will give you the availability to put some other uh, applications uh, launch on the uh, notification uh, bar. It, it's called VM Bottoms. Uh, you just add the ones that you liked and uh, it will launch from there. So it's, it's really useful. Uh, to be honest, I don't do, use them all that much because I like to have room for all my notifications but it, it, the, option, the option is there if you want to use it. Also if you see the settings, uh, they're really close of what the S5 has right now. Uh, the download booster is something that I really like, it's a, a notion that you can use both the Wi-Fi and the uh, cellular network to uh, download a file. Yeah, this is still present here. Um, if you see the rest of the toggles, they're all uh, automized to look like the ones on the S5. You can also do um, filters by different categories. Uh, and uh, you can see uh, there's still some icons like the one on the power saving that are not totally updated to this version but it's it, it, it nice to see so you can also as on the S5 uh, change the grid to at least view uh, I'll go back to the grid view um, now um, let me uh, show you some other features like the uh, swipe to the left that they will bring up a, a program that you already had uh, pre-defined uh, like in this case flipboard uh, and that's all done on the uh, bm2 uh, the folders are like just the, like the s5 also, you can swipe on the main weather widget to see different locations. Uh, it will bring up the uh, weather application from Samsung that it's uh, really, really cool. It, it, it's almost reminiscent of the S5. Okay, let me go to the BM2 program. Well, here you have uh, options to uh, modify the look and feel of the ROM. Uh, the first one is the battery mod. Uh, here you can change the way the battery looks, the, the, the battery icon. Um, you can change the animations, you can hide the percentage if you want to. Uh, there are a lot of different uh, animations and icons uh, this firmware gives you a little bit over 70 different uh, uh, animations uh, if you see I just changed it with the minions and now change it with the other ones uh, they're changed in real time so you can actually see how it will look like on your uh, notification bar 
so this is a, a good thing uh, on, on some other uh, tool mods you just see it after you restart or uh, reset the uh, UI interface in this case is immediately it also has a tool to remove the ads uh, at way already built in also uh, the inked effect it will it works on your lock screen and it will let you add the uh, ink color effect now the pen window manager uh, it works when you open the uh, your, when you take out your, your S Pen out of the phone it, it will let you choose different apps that you can launch at the same time uh, now uh, for the multi window on the uh, software uh, you can actually choose different software that is not optimized for this uh, operation um, this tool will basically let you choose which applications you will uh, have on, on on the on the list on, that you can choose to uh, see it on the um, multi-window display uh, there's also the launcher uh, the pull from left that I was uh, telling you uh, it had the uh, flipboard now I'm going to change it with uh, Google Maps and also has a pull up um, I'm going to replace it with uh, uh, the music application so uh, I'll do a quick test and see how this works and this is one of the mo most cool features of this ROM it's the ability to change the whole theme of the uh, ROM uh, I, I would use this iOS theme and I, I just apply it and it's working already so let me go back and show you how it looks you will update everything and uh, voila it's iOS 6 in his glory. So let me use the pull to the left. Yep. It's working. Now let me use the pull up. There you go. Okay. Uh, and the last is the call settings uh, another cool feature is that you can actually record your conversations with this uh, ROM also as you see I'm also recording my screen so leave a thumbs up if you like this video and uh, please subscribe to my channel uh, see you bye